Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for January 6th and 7th, Monday and Tuesday, for my Tauruses. Hello, my Tauruses. How are you? Well, you know when it's Monday, Tuesday, I use my Radley Valentine Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy, but remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Oop, one card goes down. So take what you like, leave the rest, okay? Now... Remember, I'm an intuitive channeler, so what that means is that I open myself up to my higher power, spirit, and let whatever message needs to come out, come out, okay? So, we have one card down. Okay, we're going to pick that up. It is face up. The other two I have put face down, and nothing's reversed for you, my Tauruses. That's kind of odd, isn't it? So, let's see what we have. Great start of the week. Great start of the week. Um, Earth energy, your energy, Capricorn and Virgo energy, solid energy, money energy. But it could also be, it could be something related to your job. It could be something related to your family. Could be something related to that interpersonal relationship too. Remember, those are the three. Job, career, work, personal, intimate, interpersonal, family. Tens transitioning, transitioning into a better I'm feeling a really good, uh, I'm feeling a really strong start of the week. Now, granted, this is the 6th and 7th. We're already seven days, you know, or by the Tuesday, we'll be seven days into 2020. And I'm feeling, you know, re a really strong, um, positive energy from you, for you, my Tauruses, okay? It, it's, again, it's, it's starting... And, and you're doing this. You're pushing yourself through this. You're making yourself move forward. You are not accepting any stops, okay? You're not, you know, what is the monopoly, you know, pass, goal, pass, pass go and, um, you know, and collect $200. I never liked to play Monopoly, sorry. <laughs> but, but, you know, pass go and, you know, and, you know, collect your 200 but it's, it's like you're not stopping. You're not stopping. Tens are transitional, so it's moving from one to another, so you're still transitioning here. But I'm feeling a lot of this um, energy, a lot of this excitement, a lot of this, um, you know, you're, you're making things happen for yourself. You, I mean, not to say, again, you know, we have a supernatural presence. You know, there is the, you know, the universe is out there. So you're, you know, you're making that connection too, but you are putting in the footwork, okay? You're putting in the footwork. You're prepping everything. You're getting your, um, you know, I don't know who this is, but you're getting your coaches, um, you know, and, and actually I do feel athletics here too. I don't know why that is. I mean, because coaches, I have a lot of people that are in the arts, so, you know, there could be that, that type of coach too, but I am feeling some athletics here too. And you are getting ready. You're getting ready. It's almost like you're getting ready for, in, you know, in the United States, in, you know, we have baseball season. It's like you're getting ready for spring training. Okay? That's okay. So the Ten of Earth is a very happy family life, financial security, finding magic in the little things in life. Next card up. The Knight of Water, Water Energy. This is a, okay, Water is, camp, is Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Fluid, Emotional. And this is the Knight. Is, this is like, not only are you doing your stuff, you're enjoying your stuff. You are emotionally involved in your stuff. You, you know, this, this means whatever, whatever this is that you're prepping for, whatever this is that you're doing your steps for. And again, I feel like my Tauruses that you are in a place where you are doing the work, okay? But it's not like it's like, oh, I'm doing the work. No, it's like, I'm doing this work. And it's, I feel this total excitement about it. I feel this total commitment about it. So that's how you're starting this whole week to do this. So now this also can mean some romance too. So, we can, you know, we do talk about those three. This could also mean some romance coming into your life. Um, you know, kind of that... You know, kind of that, um, I never hear from people from France, <laughs> but I'm also, you know how Rome, you know, you know how Paris is supposed to be the city of love and, you know, it's supposed to have the beautiful lights and, you know, the Eiffel Tower. I'm feeling kind of that type of ambiance for you. We'll see. Let me know. Emotional, romantic, enthusiastic, contemplative. 
falling in love or wedding proposals, the need to balance emotions, an invitation to a social event. Yeah, I'm kind of feeling that romantic ambiance too. It's like, you know, at least in the movies, I've never been there. Uh, but in the movies, you, you know, they look up and there it's all lit and everything and it's so beautiful. I'm feeling that for my Tauruses. Okay, now last card, here we go. The Ten of Fire, again, fire energy. Um, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius, passionate burning. It's that 10 again. And it's like, you know, you, you're just, you're just so, there's so much going on for you. There's so much going on for you, but I don't feel like you're exhausted. Again, what I said, it's like you're, in, you're invigorated. I don't feel the exhaustions that, exhaustion that it's like, you know, you've got like full days ahead and then you've got this, you know, I, I see those, those Paris lights also. So you've got that going on. This is a really, this is really high, high energy for you, my Tauruses. And I'm hoping this for you all. Um, because I feel it's also very happy energy too. Okay, that's the matter. If it was, if if you were just running around and you were just getting exhausted, I'd say no. We'd want to calm that down. But this is also happy. It's enthusiastic type of energy. So too much work. Accept help from others. Now that's the other thing too. Whatever this is that you're, whatever this is that you're working towards. Um, you know, go ahead and look towards those mentors, okay? Look towards, I, I said coach, look for that coach. Look for that one that will help you to pull it all together. You still have to be the one to do the work, but they might be able to give you some really, really good advice, you know, mentoring, you know, but again, you still have to do the work. You still have to go out there and be seen, okay? So accept help from others. Life is out of balance, stress-related, health concerns. Again, I don't feel like you're tired. I, I feel like you're invigorated. Please, though, please. Okay, my Tauruses, you're an earth sign. Please make sure you drink good water, okay? You know, not fuzzy water and not, not water with a little bit of <laughs> spirits in it. Make sure you drink a lot of water. Make sure you do get at least, I would like you to get eight, but late, make sure you do get at least seven hours sleep, you know, so that you can, you know, you can keep that energy up. Okay, because it's really high energy for your Monday, Tuesday. And I love the Paris lights. I really do. I really do. So maybe I have a lot of people, you know, in the United Kingdom. And, you know, maybe you're going to take, what is it, the channel over there or something? I don't know. I don't know. But um, I just see the Paris lights. I see this romantic um, ambiance in addition to what's going on. So let's see. Let's see, my Tauruses. So my Tauruses, if you enjoyed my reading, please remember to like, share, subscribe, and click on the bot, the, <laughs> click on the bell. <laughs> but as always, my Tauruses, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.